what's up out there everybody welcome back to the channel it is a beautiful day it is a saturday morning and you can see we got blue skies here we got some weather that's coming in talking about the high is going to be in the 80s sunshine no rain for the next two days so we got an ideal weekend for anything so i was out here and i was uh i was cleaning my f-150 up and uh but that's not the reason why i'm doing this video okay today is kind of a it's a a, a bittersweet day for me okay so and what i mean by that is that the uh the mercedes sl 550 and i've had it for uh, a little bit over three weeks now it's uh being sold today the new owner is coming by to pick it up okay so they're supposed to be high right here this afternoon now i i will not um uh bro i would not record that i would not put that on my channel because you know that's privacy you know between the seller and the owner whoever buys it you know it's a privacy thing but uh, before I do, we're gonna take a look around. I'm gonna get it cleaned up. I cleaned it up when I first came in. It's been sitting up. I've been wiping it off and everything, but uh, I'm gonna give it one last washing before it goes. Now the new owner is extremely excited about buying this car, okay? And it, it looks, it, I know it looks clean and shiny and everything. It's still a little bit dusty. So, you know, I'm just gonna give it one little last washing before I leave and clean it up. But uh, like I said, the new owner is just, ecstatic about this this vehicle because i'm telling you this is a very nice car and at the price that they're buying it for i looked them up i mean you guys can look them up go on uh go on uh to any of your car facts go to auto trade or anything like that and and you punch in what these mercedes benz for this one 2008 with 83,000 miles on it and in excellent condition Okay, there's nothing wrong with it. With all the service records, with all the service records on it, and, uh, you know, only service by qualified, um, not BMW, qualified Mercedes-Benz dealers, okay? So if I can get this door here open real quick and uh, take a look at the inside. Doors automatically lock when you close the trunk down. And... That's gonna be the last look up. See, there's a leaf in there. I'll get that cleaned out. So I'm gonna pull it out. I'm gonna get it cleaned up and everything. I've got the F-150 clean. And uh, I don't know if you guys know or not. I, I, Well, it's in one of my last video. You can see I changed up the back bumper that's on there. I put more of a stealth type of bumper that's on there. And I'll, I'll uh, show you. And if you look at the other video, you'll see, I'll tell you where I purchased it from and who I got it from. But this thing is solid, it's steel. Okay, and I'm talking about heavy, heavy as shit. It really is. It's a heavy bumper. Now, I'm still waiting. I'm still waiting. And I, they say it's supposed to be here on the 18th. My front bumper, which is going to be uh, the same type. Okay, it'll be more, look, it'll, it'll look more Raptor style, but it'll be the same type with that, uh, with that um, paint coating on it, with that, uh, you know, that black uh, type of paint coating on it. It'll be the same type, just like the back. So it's gonna match the back. I think it's gonna look pretty cool because this big thing here, I, I just, and you know, you guys know me. I, anything that's Raptor, I love it. I think Raptor is the greatest truck in the world. It's a great, great, it's a, in, in my opinion. You know, you put up a Raptor to me up against a, a Ram TRX, but it's gotta be a Raptor, the V8 one, the Raptor R. I'll take the Raptor R. I take a regular Raptor over. I take a, uh, a Raptor. I'm going to get this one out and get it cleaned up. Okay, let's see what So the 550 is going to get a touchless wash. And the reason why it's going to get a touchless wash? Touchless wash. Wash. Ugh. Okay. The 550, I'm not putting a rag or anything. I'm putting soap on it, a pre-soap on it, and I'm gonna rinse it off. The reason why it hasn't been anywhere, it's still clean. There's just some dust on it. Me, I just want to make some fun. Soap I'm using, Chemical Guys, Mr. Pink. Mr. Pink has got great suds, great soap. You can see it, it's nice and thick. 
just let it run off of it. Give it a couple of minutes because we are out in the sun and I wanted to sit up and to get any, uh, you know, water spots. <laughs> So to make this nice and easy, easy to dry, we get such lab ceramic hydro. So that's it, everybody say goodbye to the SL 550. Like I say, it's leaving today. Actually, but let me correct it. Actually, it's not leaving today. I'm gonna be keeping it for about a week because the owner has, is having a, a new space built and they're not already done with it to put it into because they don't wanna leave it sitting out and a vehicle like this, you wouldn't wanna leave it sitting out. This is something that would definitely garage. So I'll take it and I'll put it in my, my front garage up in the front. Therefore, I still get my, uh, my shot back and uh you know we'll see what happens okay so hey if you like this video please you know i say say goodbye to it it's gone i'm gonna miss it because i really liked having it in there kind of like wiping it out you know and uh you know in my opinion it was kind of you know it, it, it was kind of an honor you know to to kind of work on this car to do some stuff to it it really was you know so hit the like buttons, hit the subscribe buttons, notification buttons. I appreciate y'all tuning in to the channel and uh, we'll see you next time. Y'all have a wonderful day. We're having one here in St. Louis. Great weather. It's a beautiful day. Get out and enjoy yourselves. Peace.